scattered that the offense might abound but we are seen abounded grace did much more abound so the cure for sin is grace because where there is plenty of sin what god uses to cure it is to put plenty of grace so when somebody say grace is a license to sin he has turned his brain upside down he just allowed his brain to be turned upside down because how can grace that is the cure for sin be the license for sin you are not thinking straight it's like saying panadol gives malaria or like saying panadol is a is a supplier of headache it's like saying atesunate is the multiplier of malaria it makes no sense anywhere there is headache the first aid is panadol before the whatever is responsible for the headache is taken care of God's solution to sin is the grace of God. So where grace is applied, sin is vanquished. Where sin abounds, grace much more abounds. Is it getting clear? So the next time you hear somebody say, all these grace preachers, grace preachers, don't mind them. It's hyper grace. If grace is not hyper, it is not grace. You didn't hear that if grace is not hyper it is not grace there is no economized grace grace is extravagant god commended his love towards us in that while we were church goers in that while we were morally good when did god's grace come to us while we were yet because it is the grace that will cure the sin behold the lamb of god that take it away who is the lamb of god jesus full of grace we will preach this thing on the mountain we will preach it in the valley from pillar to pillar from continent to continent from nation to nation from city to city from village to village on the mountain in the valley every man that jesus died for must hear the message if you're saying amen to that you'll be a part of this god's cure for sin is grace we are sin abounded grace much more so if somebody said don't mind grace preachers what he's saying is i don't want to be free from sin anybody said don't listen to grace preachers what he's saying is i want to save myself for by grace are you saved so if you don't mind grace you cannot be saved salvation is by grace by grace not by works lest any man should boast it is the gift once something becomes doria gift it means it is grace because grace is what you don't qualify for that is gifted you it is a gift of god if it's by works nobody will qualify out of works lest any man should boast god saw that man cannot so God did it for us. It is God's extravagant, hyper, reckless, superlative Zapata. Titalutu Bulaka. The grace of God. The grace of God. Somebody shout hallelujah.